Welcome to a video taking a look at probability tree diagrams. Here we're told that the probability of Steve being late for school is 0.4. The probability that Eleanor will be late for school is 0.2. Complete the probability tree diagram. So here we've been given our tree diagram already. Um, we can see that we've got Steve here and the probability of him being late is 0.4 as represented by this line here going towards late and we're given that that probability is 0.4. Now the probability of Steve being not late, well our probabilities simply need to add up to 1. If the probability of him being late is 0.4 then the probability of him not being late must be 0.6 because those two numbers there have to add up to 1. Okay, now on to Eleanor. Now if Steve is late then there's still the probability that Eleanor could also be late as well or she could not be late. If the probability of her being late is 0.2 then the probability of her not being late must be 0.8. Uh, similarly again if the probability of Steve being um, not late is 0.6 and so if Steve is not late there is the probability that Eleanor could be late but she could also not be late. The probability that she is late is 0.2 and the probability that she is not late must be 0.8. Okay, now sometimes we may be asked questions about this um, probability tree diagram as well so we filled it out. We may also be asked questions such as work out the probability that they are both going to be late. So let's take a look at that, that possibility. So if we follow the tree diagram through, Steve could be late and Eleanor could be late. So we could say that they're both late. Then Steve could be late and then Eleanor could be not late. So we'll call that late and then not late. Steve could be not late but then Eleanor could be late. So we'll call that NL. And then Steve could not be late and Eleanor could also not be late. So there are four possible combinations of Steve and Eleanor being late. We are looking for the probability that they are both late. So what I'll do is let's highlight that route through the probability tree. So the probability that Steve is late is 0.4. The probability that Eleanor would also be late is 0.2. Now in order to figure out for the, uh, the probability that they are both late, all that we are going to do is multiply those probabilities together and that will tell us the probability of them both being late. So 0.4 multiplied by 0.2 that gives us 0.08. So the probability that they're both late is the probability of Steve late multiplied by the probability that Eleanor is late. So that gives us a probability in total of 0.08. Okay, let's take a look at a second question that we may be asked. So the second question we may also be asked is work out the probability, work out the probability that only one of them is late. So again, let's look at the routes where that could happen. So we could have the possibility that Steve is late but Eleanor is not late. Or we could have the combination where Steve is not late but Eleanor is late. So both of those routes through the tree would result in one of them being late. In the first case Steve being late and Eleanor not being late and in the second case Steve not being late but Eleanor being late. Now in order to figure out what the probability would be we need to calculate the probability of each of these and simply add them together. So the probability of Steve being late and Eleanor not being late would be 0.4 so that's the probability that Steve is late multiplied by the probability that Eleanor is late is not late sorry which is 0.8 and so that would give us 0 0.32 0.4 times 0.8 now the other
combination where we could have just one of them being late would be for Steve not to be late, that's 0 0.6 and Eleanor to be late which is 0 0.2 so that gives us a probability of 0 0.12 now to calculate the total probability then well you've got you could have 0 0.32 or 0 0.12 and so the probability that just one of them is late is going to be the probability added together which is 0 0.44 so in this one here the probability was that Steve was late but Eleanor was not late in this one um, Steve was not late but Eleanor was late and so we've just added those two probabilities together to give us the total probability that only one of them is late of 0 0.44.